हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग नाउ वी केम अप विथ अनदर इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक एंड ऑल यू नो व्हाट इज दिस इट्स अबाउट जॉन डन लेट्स डिस्कस सम इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चंस रिगार्डिंग जॉन डन दिस फ्रीक्वेंटली आस्क फॉर एचएससी एचएसएसटी फॉर नेट सेट पीएचडी एटसेट्रा सो हियर टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग सम इंपॉर्टेंट questions on john dunn's a well diction forbidding morning and his the canonization so let's start first one john dunn was born in when was john dunn born option a 1570 b 1572 c 1574 d 1575 was born in 1572 john dunn was born on 1572 second question John Donne famously wrote John Donne and Donne and Donne in connection with dash John Donne famously wrote John Donne and Donne and Donne in connection with a the change of his religion b death of his wife and m c loss of his position following this marriage d death of his doctor so right answer is c loss of his position following his marriage third one who commented done for not keeping a accent deserved hang who commented done for not keeping accent deserved hang ben jones right answer is ben jones fourth one who portrayed the love affair between john dunn and ann mo in the novel the lady and the poet who portrayed the love affair between john dunn and ann mo in the novel the lady of the poet a may heron b king slamis c lane bear d jan morris right answer is maybe heron so right answer is maybe heron fifth one which of the following poem written by t s eliot praises john dunn among the following which poem written by t s eliot praises john dunn option a whispers of immortality b portrait of a lady C the wasteland and D Geronch so the right answer is option A whispers of immortality of six one the term metaphysical poets was coined by or who coined the term metaphysical poet A John Dryden B T S Eliot C John Donne D Dr Samuel Johnson so the right answer is Dr Samuel Johnson so Dr Samuel Johnson coined the term metaphysical poets okay then seventh one dr samuel johnson coined the term metaphysical poet in the biography of dash dr samuel johnson coined the metaphysical poet in the biography of a john dun b george herbert c abraham cowley and d richard crasho so the right answer is c abraham cowley he affect the metaphysics in his amorous verse where nature only should reign perplex the mind of fair sex with nice speculation of philosophy when he engage their heart who criticizes john dun like this option b john dryden ninth one who i mean the following is not a metaphysical poet option a richard crasho andrew marvel henry vaughan kingsley amis kingsley amis 10th one A valediction for bidding morning is written on the occasion of dash. The way poem A valediction for bidding morning is written on the occasion of dash. Poet's wedding anniversary, B poet traveling away from his wife, the death of his wife, death of queen of England. Right answer is B. The poet traveling away from his wife. The right answer is B. 11th one. Why does the poet declare that love is like pure gold? Why the poet declare that their love is like the pure gold a because it shines as pure gold because it can't be stretched and disintegrate because it is beyond any other treasure of the earth because it's like an ornament for them right answer is b because it can be stretched and disintegrate 12th one according to the speaker lovers who can't cope up with absence are according to the speaker lovers who can't cope up with absence are sublunary divine royal noble right answer is sublunary okay what sort of men are said to pass smilingly we in the poem see which is man then what is the boy considered as profanation of their joy 
want to support considered as profanation of their job to reveal their love to lady to reveal their love to lady according to speaker what bring him back home a his wife beauty his craving to see his wife his wife fidelity and his wife firmness right and says d his wife firmness so i de- i decided to keep all my lessons in short so the rest of answer regarding john dunn will come in the next part 2 this is part 1 of john dunn discussion of the two chapters veil diction for body morning and the canonization so wait for the part 2 and it will come soon stay safe study well goodbye